What will we do to bring back our culture and our tradition? We don't care about our tradition again. And we don't even practice the Western world very, very even well. In fact, let me put it this way, we don't even know what we are we doing. We take care, we take care, we take care. We don't take even care. know what we are doing. Okay. That is the summary of everything. We don't know what we are doing. Civilization now, they forget culture. They know they follow culture again. Now Igbo style with the shop. Food where with the shop? Now Igbo food. Nigeria food, you know better. Food where we say chemical don't fool and for outside country. Now that they carry and come Nigeria with the bam. Make I tell you a good example. Okay. Everything where they made, they say now made in Nigeria. Nigeria know they buy them. About they made, they say about no good. But our person don't wear them before. You go carry 1,005, go buy them. Under bridge, you should. Everywhere, Okrika. Try buy them. Now you go to buy them. Person don't wear them before. Come put them for precision. They want wear about they made for Nigeria. You no good to buy. Now only Nigeria know they do quality things. Okay. China, before we hear China, 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 China. China get many, all the things where they use for Nigeria today in China. China get original. Okay. China. China. Okay. It get original. It get the fake one. Now no go think of that one. No. But once you don't cross border, come Nigeria, now it be better. You know, media set agenda for the people. Okay. So media have to set more agenda concerning our own culture, not the European culture or the Western world. So limit some of these uh, 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 content. uh, contents and promote our own more. That is one of the way. By doing this, we see we receive more education concerning our own culture. If we don't receive more education and everybody wants Western culture, especially by what we watch in movie, in films, our own will continue to lose value. So it's just only for the media now to set a very good agenda setting promoting our own culture so that we will be higher than their own culture. That is the only advice I can give. Then secondly, our parents also are not doing good. Parents are not doing good. They allow the children to be loose. I remember in the, in the 80s, even early 90s, in the village, you hardly see a woman wear trousers. And if you want to wear trousers, you know the type of trousers you wear. But this one, and they even wear the one that is tear, tear. You know, the tear, tear, tear and they are going around and say it's homies. All these things are European culture, it's not our culture. You know, no respect. Even then, you see ladies hide to do things. Now the aspect of immorality okay. is one another aspect again. In fact, every board, nearly 80% uh, of Nigerians copy Western immorality. It's to train the children well. Sometimes repaying how we parents, we, the way we behave with the, with the children, some they don't want to train the children very well. Some they maybe they will see a child is doing something that he's not supposed to do. It's still for you to stop that child not to do that thing. You still you support that child. Some of us like ladies now. We have some some child that we like more than others, and which is very bad. You have to love your children the same way you you born all of them. You have to love them together. Okay. So. We need to train them very well. And, ah, tradition and culture. Ah, this thing, uh, what I want to talk about tradition and culture, we say civilization don't spoil everything. You understand? Civilization don't spoil everything. Why you say spoil everything? I want to say, all these days now, if you want to greet your papa now, all these days, you go kneel down or you prostrate. But nowadays, you go want to check your papa and say, Papa, ah, yeah, far. Yeah. you understand? So all those things, the civilization is just for everything. Before I can talk, mm. can you allow me to sing one song? Sing the song. It says, today is the day of salvation. Today is the day of repentance. If you delay, tomorrow may be late. If you delay, tomorrow may be late. If you delay, tomorrow may be late. There is danger if you delay. What we're supposed to do is that it's our elder that causes it to. Oh. Because little children do not know anything. It is what they are hearing they, will they used to practice. If you see little children now, you are causing on behalf of that children, 
He said, bye bye, yeah. The little little children will start to be saying, yeah, bye bye, yeah, bye bye, one car, this and that. But if they did not hear that language for elderly person, they will never say that thing. So, this thing is coming, the fault is from us. Now you send your children to school, Yoruba, mm. he has his own culture. Okay. Uh -huh. Onyibo has his own. Mm. Uh -huh. General Nigeria has his own culture. Okay. Now, elderly person, you started copy character of uh, Onyibo. Onyibo people. Now it is what you copy that your children will copy. When you send your children to school, your children get into class, the teacher say, hey children, stop speaking vernacular. Eh? The children were afraid. He doesn't want to speak in, speak your dialect. No Yoruba. The way they train me, I never see where woman smoke. And I never see where uh, little children started smoking. In olden days, so we they used to train children. When a father is talking to children, mother too will join. They will put mouth. The children will come. Proper upbringing. Why did I say proper upbringing? If you want whatever you want your child to be in the future, you have to start it from when he or she is little. Okay. The way our parents, like the way they, my parents will always tell me, that the way their parents brought them up that they have this respect up to today is because of what their parents did when they were small. He said when a child gets to the age of 15, 16, they start misbehaving. But if you, if you invent a good manner into them, no matter how they go astray, they will still remember that background teaching that you give to them. Now through shall life for Igbo. Igbo, only they, to greet, good morning sir, good morning ma, they go go their way. But like for this year, uh, our Yoruba land, can bow and hell like this. Greet, salute. That what do you make that now they do them again? For they see they do them, but not everybody they do them. But I, I count for as the way they do now, they don't have computer age. Mm. Nobody like before, before as they do them, before now, they do them now. They go say, as now, we live for new life, new computer age. So, not like before. What do you do to help our culture and tradition? Ah, many things. Because let's start from the background, from home uh, teaching. Because many parents nowadays, we don't teach, they don't teach their children about the culture and background again. Just like the old days, like our mothers, if they, if they go out with their children, if they say sit down there, or if someone wants to give you something, if your mother, the olden days, if they look at you with face, you will understand what they are saying. But nowadays, children, if mommy says sit, you start playing. If mommy says do this, ah, you start saying, oh, this mama will allow too much. And meanwhile, we are forgetting our culture because of now, nowadays we are chasing money instead of we teaching our children the culture and the ways of our land. Uh, what thing we go do, to me, oh, I don't see, say, na government custom, because you don't see some parents now. They don't have, they, they know they get the time again to stay for house, to take care of their children the way it's supposed to be. Why? Because all, all the parents now, then they find way to take, make money to okay. give their picking food. So that time where they go come sit down, they take care of their children, they show them the thing we've been there back, back, back before we were even born, where our parents don't already, they show us where we don't learn. The time no day again, because then they hustle for money, made them first chop food. So now, to me, oh, as you say, now the way the country don't turn, I make the thing come be like that. Now somebody like me, I'm a damn food driver, I'm a boss, a commercial driver. If I tell you what is happening in the streets now, I can tell you sometimes it is even difficult. Gone are those days where they, where they will tell you commercial drivers are the kings. It's no longer the case. It's the Agberos. Yes, it's the Agberos. It's the government officials who are the kings now. Because what we actually get, it's even far, far lower than what they get in return from us. And at the end of the day, you see parents, parents who strive hard to make sure that they give their children good education and every other thing. Now, back to that, you see that even most of the, most of the, our government has failed in that situation where parents can easily take their schools, their awards back to public schools now. Now, the order of the day is that you must, be, you must take your child to a private school, which if you cannot do, then you are nobody in the society. 
your child or your words will be assumed or presumed to be somebody who is not having a quality education. Every service for us of God get closing prayer, my country people. So I'm saying that the Western culture where we imitate now is poor things for inside of Bodon Niger. Lastly, uh, make our parents, our papa, our mama them, uh, make we try, give our children home training. My country people, my name is Mr. Peace MC with our biggest swag. You want to follow me on top Instagram and Twitter at Mr. Peace Official. For inside Facebook, Mr. Peace. Now so we see him. My country people, they say that person will tip one my foul. I know it is the final. For this chunch, we're going to end the matter for today. Make you not touch that, make your finger for no. We don't work out. Huh?